A decade ago, this berry seemed poised to be the next big superfood that was only for a hot second. It was quickly dethroned by Akai. No doubt, Akai does have some advantages, but it isn't necessarily better. The fact that it's a common ingredient in health-oriented foods and available in the form of Akai bowls around every corner in California has more to do with availability. It's easier to get with a reliable supply chain because it's cultivated in Brazil. Everyone knows that purple fruit, but few know about Macui. It might offer some unique benefits for your health. What is Macui Berry? Macui berries come from an evergreen tree native to Chile. With a diameter of only a quarter inch, these tiny purple berries pack a large antioxidant punch, thanks to their anthocyanins. Anthocyanins are a broad category of pigments responsible for producing blues, purples, and reds in plants. The color expressed largely depends on the pH. There are several major types and the one most prevalent in Macui are delphinid and anthocyanins. Remember that form, because it appears to be responsible for some of the benefits. Concord grapes, blueberries, and blackberries also contain delphinid and anthocyanins, but the amount in Macui is exponentially higher. Historically and to this very day, they have been an important food in the diet of the Mapuche Indians. Native to south-central Chile, they are the only tribe of the continent who were never conquered by the invading colonists from Europe. Fresh and powder are rich in antioxidants, according to ORAC, which is the best in vitro test for measuring antioxidant activity. Fresh Macui has an ORAC value of 19,850 per 100 grams serving. That's even more than black raspberries at 19,220 and elderberries at 14,697. Their antioxidant content is at least 400% higher than fresh blueberries, sea buckthorn, goji, and strawberries. Decreases oxidized cholesterol. In a double-blind and placebo-controlled trial conducted in Italy, 42 people were given a Macui berry supplement or a placebo to take three times daily for four weeks. Before and after, blood samples were taken to measure their oxidized LDL cholesterol. For each category of participants, which included healthy, overweight, and smokers, there was a reduction in oxidized LDL. This was further confirmed in another reading taken 40 days after supplementation stopped when their oxidized LDL returned to baseline. Oxidized LDL is a contributor to atherosclerosis and heart disease. Inhibits inflammation in multiple ways. Scientists at the University of Chile used mice macrophages, which are a type of white blood cell, and triggered an inflammatory response in them. Next, they exposed these cultured cells to tiny amounts of fruit extracts, macui, caliphate, and Chilean blueberries. Those fruits are all native to their region. The cells treated with macui extract had the best response, according to several inflammatory markers. Up to 45.6% less nitric oxide was released. Only Macui was able to completely revert the effect of IL-10 gene expression. A 25.1% reduction in MCP1 Mr. Na content. Potential for pain relief. Many forms of pain are caused or worsened by inflammation. In a rat paw study in which inflammation was triggered using carrageenan, the berry extract reduced expression of the COX-2 enzyme even better than the naproxen sodium it was compared. This enzyme is a major culprit in osteoarthritis back pain, and other joint disorders. It also affects rheumatoid arthritis, menstrual cramps, and more. Several prescription pain medications work by being a COX-2 inhibitor, such as Celebrex and Biox. Dry eye relief. It has been reported that the delphinidins anthocyanins reduce damage to photoreceptor cells caused by light stimulation and help protect cells in the eye from free radical damage. Together, these benefits may reduce chronic low-grade injury to the lacrimal glands which in turn, supports their ability to make tears may reduce lung injury from smoking. To be clear, tobacco, cigarettes, and other forms of smoking lead to lung damage and cancer regardless of what you eat or supplements you take. Still, there are recommendations in place to hopefully reduce those risks, even if reduction may be trivial. It may help with blood sugar. Delphinate and anthocyanins have been associated with a decrease in glucose absorption. This happens through the inhibition of a glucosidase enzymes, which are the final step in the digestion of carbs. When their activity is reduced, blood sugar is slower to rise, since the carbs take longer to be absorbed. Weight loss. Lipase inhibitors are drugs used to reduce the activity of lipases found in the intestine. Lower lipase activity leads to lower absorption of fats. This is why there are prescription medications for obesity that work by being lipase inhibitors. Preliminary research has found that macui berry for weight loss may work through an inhibitory effect on lipase activity. It has been reported to have a great inhibitory effect though human trials to measure have not been done.
That's it for today. Check out the channel for more health and weight loss content. You can also purchase our weight loss course. And please, like and subscribe to be notified of our next tip. See you next time.